Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. I see our party has got 0.6 days left. That's pretty much where we left them last time. And otherwise, everyone back over here is off doing their things. Most of them are going to bed. It's midnight. But I saw that Natalia was making um, medicine over here. I got a note from Stephanie, who's binge-watching the series trying to catch up, that she thought she saw somebody in one of the earlier episodes gaining art artistic skill I'm, it, when they were making uh, drugs the drug lab I'm curious to see if that's the case I haven't actually tested it yet so 104 and let's see if that does move did not okay let's go a little bit further what does move here so art is not at least if I read that right um one making medicine. Yep, that was the comment. So 104, we're not making, we're not doing anything. Otherwise, uh, crafting. 87. I came away with the conclusion last time that 86, yeah, we don't actually gain much in the way of making medicine in regard to skill. We actually lose, but we're gaining medicine. So we're losing crafting skill. Intellectual? 63, 62, we're losing intellectual. And art is still at 104. Are we losing mining? <laughs> I mean, making medicine apparently really dumbs you down. 45. No, growing. Construction, 96. Hmm. Anyway, oh, medicine. What's to do to medicine? That should be the obvious question, huh? We are making it quite quick, though. 35. So medicine seems okay. Nope, 34. We're losing a lot of skill making medicine. That is really odd. I'll take the medicine, though. That seems to be the penalty you get, but maybe maybe the chemicals involved in making the medicine kind of burns out some brain cells or something. I'm not sure, but that is really odd the way that does that. Um, otherwise, what's up? Who's up? David's up. David is hauling wood to shelf. Dolores is pregnant. Hauling wood. Oh, grabbing wood from here. And we're building... Ah, shelves. Okay. So I went through and, and redid a lot of the uh, the storage... Um, yeah, whatever you'd call this. The, the parameters or the... You know, what, what we're going to store there. In a lot of the, the new shelving units here and there. Including getting... I think this whole section here set up for cloths and hides so that uh, we can get more of that over here that doesn't fit over here and try to make clean up a little bit. Corazon is up and doing what I asked. You're going to do that, then you're going to grab maybe a rifle and put it away somewhere or not. <laughs> Otherwise, what's going on over here? Radar is up, probably grab breakfast. Nope, cutting stone blocks. And his food is fine. And Cathra is up. Sewing area. Who are you going to go wake up? Nobody at the moment. We need to get somebody actually living there or something. But we need to build some more of these too. Huh. Gnarly is up. Hauling silver to sterile tile. So that's not over here. You're going over to finish off the jail. Ah, we're just finishing up these areas over here. Okay. So you are medical. Right there. Uh, bird meat has rotted away in storage. I asked Grandma to do a bunch of butchering. How's that been going? She's doing it, and still we're not catching up. We need two of them butchering. Michael needs... Why don't you grab a meal, and then why don't you come over and do some butchering for me? And you can do that with Grandma, get a bunch of the stuff converted into, into what we can use over here. We're good on pemmican, we're good on kibble. And what I'm thinking about, let's see, can I do that? You guys are now 0.3 days away. If I popped into here, should we go back and pick up all of this slate stone waiting for us? Curious. I'm also curious, I've never had two colonies or two maps sitting here. Will any events happen in this map when we're not here? Don't know. Will a raid go through here and bust everything up and take it and, and 
go away. You know, take all you know, steal all of our stone and our, and our wood. <laughs> steal our our cloth bedrolls or something. I don't know. But uh, world, pop back into this one, zoom in, and like 0.2 days left. What is 0.2 days? Two tenths of a day. So by noon we should be home, thereabouts. So just in time for a raid to pop in, right? What are you? You are ground penetrating. Ah, that's right. So we have 56 um, components coming in. I'm curious to see what's going to happen. If I don't assign any more tasks to work on, they should work on everything that is not completed yet. Everything has been started. So I would imagine everything has been waiting for three components across the whole map is going to suddenly get started working on, including this one. Uh, it takes 12 components there. Wow. And this one over here, you're here somewhere. There. So we need... 200 steel, build complete, making sculpture. Bliss, you are consuming a fine meal. Don't know what you were doing. What were you doing? You headed this direction. Um, I don't... I'm trying to think of why Bliss would have been here. He's set to crafting, right? Bliss, you're down here now. You are set to smithing. No, that's tailoring. And then you're set to crafting, then you're set to hauling. Oh. How could there be no crafting for you? Because there are no stones over here again. No, Natalia took over. Ah, oh, I see. And for some reason, you're not qualified to do this? Hmm. Okay. I was wondering if I shouldn't have you construct this one next. Why don't you do that one when you're done grabbing a meal? And let's see if we can't get this long-range mineral scanner going, get ready for components. We'll get this guy up and running, ready for components, and we'll get to play with those in the next few episodes. But do we head back after the next raid and go grab a bunch of slate stone and get that turned into blocks? And use slate on one side and sandstone on another, and what is the fifth one? I don't remember. Um, let's just grab one of these and do it this way. That didn't work. There. Storage. That would be chunks. Uh, limestone, no, limestone, granite, marble, sandstone, slate. So these two are over there, and we got limestone here. So we've got three other stones we've not used on floors anywhere in the base. We could do one, two, three different kinds of floors in there. That might be kind of interesting, but we need access to those chunks in order to do it. Hate to make a expensive trip to another map section and risk being raided and, and attacked and all that just to bring back rock <laughs> you know it just doesn't seem uh, the smartest way to oh that's right i had set these guys well i'll set them for kibble that's fine you guys can kibble everything out and then you'll be doing a bunch of hauling that should be fine except for that one right there everything is in a stockpile so it should all be counting toward that 600. Yeah, that way we're guaranteed never to run out of kibble. Hate doing that. Hate getting the message that an animal is starving. We are at 10 o'clock now. World, you guys are still 0.2 days away. That's about 0.1. There it is. So we're almost home. I'm waiting for the angry red message to come down. We've got a herd of deer over here. Some booms over there. Don't need to tame any more booms. Bunch of pigs. What was that moving real quick? That was a raccoon. Okay. Ostriches have found each other. They were in two different places before. Unless that's a difference. So there's a lot of animals around here now. More pigs and more ibex. And anything. Oh, another herd of deer over here. Wow. We have so much wood or so much uh, meat in, in the fridge already. We just don't need to go after them. But. Uh, Sure is available if you wanted it to, but I'd really like to see this stuff all butchered before we have anything start to go bad. It's frozen, won't spoil, just need one freezer to go bad and we're in trouble. If I had to, if this freezer started to have problems, I can open doors and I guess we could open that door and transfer this cold into there if we had to. But yeah, let's, let's get all that process and get it used. Um, noon, I gotta be here any minute now. Bring the components in, unload, pause, unload where? 
I would imagine they're going to go to this. Is that still the best place? Components are going this way. Hay is going this way. Um, the rest of its food goes that way. Let's move that over. Build into there. We'll unload in this area. They'll walk right through there and go to it. So let's make you go away. I think that's the best tactic. So we need a... I guess that'll be right here. Maybe this will be the new... Uh, loading area. That's kind of a central point to to hay and to all the weapons and stuff to trade, whatever stored down in here, and the food over there. That kind of works. I want it to be a different material, so it... Yeah, I guess not. Let's just make it a little bit bigger. All the way out to there. Like... It doesn't have to be enclosed, either. It doesn't have to be. Yeah, something like that. So let's cancel these. Eric, what you doing? You're hauling steel to revise turret. Only two of them. Let's pass on that. Can you tear these down for me? Now, there's no reason that that's a problem, right? I don't have any roofs that are going to collapse in that area. Um, one two, three, four, I think that's five or less. That should be fine. Over here, is that a problem? Five out, not five out. I feel like there's a problem right there. That this is holding that. Let's cancel that one for now. Okay. I think that will support anything out here in the middle until this wall gets built. And then, Bliss. Why don't you, while oh, you're in this area, you're still close enough. Bring over some stone before you head off and do whatever you're going to be doing. Okay. Otherwise, sterile tile is in. Hospital rooms are done over here. We could do the same thing over here. That was a mistake to put that in. This should be, this was meant to be kind of a surgery. It's just, we shut it down because... Uh, they were going over here instead of the real hospital. So I guess that's something I have to turn on for the moment. But this probably should be sterile tile over here. That would make sense. If we do have to use it in an emergency, it would be good that it was already set up for them. So let's do that. You guys can, can go and attack that one eventually. But we should be popping in with components here real soon. I'm just noticing the batteries. Ooh, we're starting to look like... Uh, like we know what we're doing here. It is 1400. Let's put the rest of today into that bank. So let's turn you off. And who is outside already? Michael, you are making kibble after you flick that switch. Nope. Caravan has arrived. Here they are. So come on down, guys. And Miss B, you are unloading inventory. Why are they not moving? Oh, good. I was a little worried there. Um, um, come on, just let's let's go. Okay, I get to thinking maybe they weren't going to come down until the others had reached this point or something, and that would add another half a day to our. You guys are seriously waiting. No, 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 no! Don't do this to me. You are wandering. How are you guys unloading? Do you really have to go all the way down here just to go all the way back there and get them to bring them back down here again? Tell me that's not true. Please? Miss B's taking her time. They're just going to sit here. Oh, Rimworld. The baby one is carrying something. Here, you have 75 steel on you. Why is the baby one wandering that far away? Cyprian, what you doing? You're milking Muffalo 3. Okay, you're waiting to be milked or something. So what are these guys doing? Right over Sea Stars, Oath Knight. You are unloading... In oh, you're unloading your own inventory. In other words, your pemmican and emu leather and stuff. Do I have to tell you guys to go unload them? I'm really kind of wondering. Sangria's going to go do what she needs to do. So, Tomislav, you're researching. Can I tell you to unload Muffalo 3? But can I tell you not to do it over here? That is weird. 
I don't remember this last time. I don't remember doing that. I can't tell a Mufflo to go somewhere, right? I mean, that's right there. We'll do Clyde. I can't tell you to head over to here. No. Huh. Oh, I need to reassign you. Oh, that would work. Okay, that's... Okay. Got to work through the brain deadness here. So you guys are all down over here. I want to get this done. I want to get those components going. So let's take you all to the kibble zone. That's probably the, the best way to deal with it. So down here, muffalos. Ah, we just were not even registered yet. Okay. So you guys are all heading down into here. Those are the four muffalo. And then the two alpacas. All right. That gets you going. Now what happened with the ones who are trying to be milked? Are we going to have to chase them now? Let's, let's see what happens here. Um, yeah, Cyprian is chasing Merit, Merat, and Sangria is, is, oh, she caught that one. You're already done. Okay, you guys are all heading down here, then I'll get somebody to unload them as you get into this area. Then we're at 1700, going to 22. Hmm, so five hours, well, four hours once they get here to, for the pigs to go put everything away. Okay, I guess we can do that. How'd this go? Did we get 200 in there? We got 200. So waiting for the components. All right. So that's what we've got to do. We have to animal zone them. And pause. I need to get everybody's bed reassigned, don't I? i got to remember where everyone was. Unowned, you were sea stars. Now you're all at the bottom of the list now. Yeah, starting all over. Billy, Cyprian, George, K, Manuela, over here, unknowns or unassigned, unowned. That's the word I want. Um, red, that was nobody. Diamond was there, Radar. Kaya, you were here? I want... No, Kaya's there. Who was that one? All right, process of elimination. I know that was Oath Knight. So you, bottom, right there. Handy, you are over here, right there. So add a Handy back in. Alicia, you were probably this one. So, oh, there we go. I just saw, okay, Klaus is up there. That's right. Um, Alicia, you're right there. So Miss P, Rabbit, and Sean Tico. Miss P, you were off to over in this area. I want to say there. Rabbit was at the bottom. Okay, Rabbit, there. Miss P, right there. And that leaves Sean Tico right here. Now, have I missed anybody? So, Sea Stars, Oath Knight, Handy, Alicia, Miss P, Rabbit, Shantigo. That is seven. All right, we're good. So, you guys are done. You can head to bed whenever you need to. Uh, handy, sleep is fine. Everyone just grabbed a meal or? Yeah, unloading inventory. You're still getting rid of your inventory, which is gold. Gear. You got gold to get rid of. Okay. So, you're dropping off what you've got, then you're going to grab meals. And just jumping right back into your old routines. Do the old routines still exist? Alicia is still set to growing and mining. Okay, that looks good. Um, a sign. We still have no drugs on everybody, so it maintained that. Okay. So I guess we're good. I may have to stare at this a little bit. Oh, look at the components are dropping in. Where do those components come from? The animals are... Maybe one of them had the components on them that's possible yep i guess so so let's get these guys unloaded they're just arriving who can do it manuela consuming a fine meal daniel you are unloading buffalo calf automatically doing it interesting okay do i need to cyprian you're probably sewing you're training can you come over and reserve by rabbit Okay, you can do that one, and Oath Knight, you need food. Okay, Klaus, there you are. Needs, you're fine. You're hauling components to wood fire generators. Let's let the constructors do their job. Okay, so you can come over and unload. No, no, that's reserved. Clyde is reserved. He's not available. You are res unloading alpaca one. Okay, 
and do we have one more possibility? Radar and Bliss could be doing construction. Yeah, I'll let them do blocks. So I need one more volunteer. Kaya is hauling steel to improvise turret. David is constructing. Handy's constructing. Eric's constructing. Who else can do one last unloading job? Alicia, you are grabbing a fine meal. When you're done, where is our sixth animal? Let me think about things here. One, two, three. We have another alpaca somewhere. Oh, no, we have that one and that one that they're already done. We have two, we have three adult muffalo and one baby. And Daniel is doing the baby. Are they outside still? They're still out here. And that one's not giving me a click. And that one's not giving me a click. So you guys have been unloaded? No. I don't know why I couldn't right click that. Just randomly, Billy? Nope, I can't right. Zoom in here. Nope. Will not let me unload even though they're still there. So, don't know what that means. Maybe they have to get to a destination first. Or they have to get into their, their zone. Oh, that might be it. So if I were to just randomly pick Billy and you're now in the, the zone. Nope. There we go. Reserved by Rabbit. So I can do it once I'm in there. Um, so who? Billy, you are not Grandma Gnarly. Sea Stars. Sea Stars, what you doing? You're still unloading inventory too. Okay. What is your inventory that you're unloading? Uranium. Okay, drop all that off. Now you are sewing area. Why don't you come up and help out over here too? Can you? You can unload number three. All right. Rabbit's busy, busy unloading. Uh, Cyprian, you are consuming that fine meal. Okay, when you're done, come back up and... Nope, nope, nope. Huh. So I guess we've got these all assigned. All right. Maybe they'll take care of it all on their own. So with that, what is next? All the construction going on. Look at that. Generators are going in like crazy. We're going to shut these guys down. Not going to worry about it. Batteries did what for the night? We were running this bank only. We got it mostly filled. Let's see if we can get through the night with those. You are a no. Pause. And you are a no. Klaus. Building granite auto door. You can flick switch, flick switch, flick switch, flick switch. No. Okay, you canceled it. Good. You were stuck in a doorway. All right, these are all off. What else just got built that we don't need built? Or we don't need running. That's done. That's not being worked on yet. Getting all of these guys, but they will be dead to the world because the switches are off. Any new switches just get thrown in. You're on. You need to go off. So flick you. And let's pick somebody close. Oath Knight is praying. Um, that, let's see why. 20 hundred. So I can't tell you to do another joy activity if I assign that to you. Who else is in this area? Nobody. Okay. Cyprian, Joy, you're in better shape. So when you're done eating, then you come on down and, and do that. Okay. Not built yet. These are all off. Oh, thought I was running. Um, oh, these are waiting for a component before these are going to be built. So we'll have to watch out for switches suddenly turning on. Okay. So when will the next raid hit? What was our last event? Well, we had several events over in the other one regarding animals and whatnot, so it's possible that those took the place of the raids. Yeah, that might be. Otherwise, we've got milk rotting up here. Great. They just had to milk them. <laughs> um, I guess I'd, if I'd thought of it, I could have had... Uh, Sangria bring those all home, but didn't think of it. You guys are bringing in granite chunks. Yeah. Who's got a tattered peril right now? Sea Stars does. And gear, it's because what? Forced. There it is. Shield belt forced. Let's just go ahead and let's go here. Restrict? Assign. Forced, Faith, and Forced, right there, 49%. OK, 
Okay, we'll do that. So with that cleared, C Stars is still sewing. So she's not overly concerned about it right now. Um, how did the sorting do? I did ask the power armor to go up there. I asked for shield belts to pop into here, I think. I see that didn't happen yet. Asked for a lot of the clothes to go into this perimeter. Oh, wow, we're built. Those shelves weren't there before. All right, all of the lower quality clothes that are not um, military-like clothes that are 69 points or less to drop in through here. So let's J or paste all of these so they can continue to do that, get them off the floor and into these areas. All right, we'll go with that for now. Well, I guess we'll get these done too because otherwise all of our weapons are going this way. Okay, we'll do that. Then what? Um, we did get the cloth brought over. Okay, waiting for these to fill up so we get more cloth over. We have a lot of cloth. So I suppose it is time to go ahead and thin out the cloth inventory next time we get a, a good, uh, good seller. So components now. Let's turn that off. Components are... Are they in this one? No. Where are components? You're not in that pile or else we're already gone. Where are components? They're stored over here. Nope, we have nine left. Only nine and they're gone. We did get the ground penetrating scanner built though. All right. Well. Yeah. We have green clouds. If you watch if you were looking at the radar right now, the Doppler, you get a little concern about all the the little green cells that we're building up over us, all the little beginnings of thunder cells. Um tell me what you think these are. Let's go with where would it be best to put power? We've got power now available to get into this area. And oh boy, there's something over here. Of course, the the uh, the drill is only going to do a small patch. But there is some mass of something here, which is probably multiple uh, deposits. Probably have three deposits sitting right here all on top of each other. But I'm thinking that's probably something like a compact uh, steel. I'm guessing this... Oops, let's go back there that one. Probably looking at uh, compact machinery. Probably looking at, oh, what would be a smaller one? Anyway, give me your thoughts on what you see here. Power-wise, we've got lots of power available up here. So we could definitely run something, say, there, there. Um, what do we got for steel? We have a thousand steel. So we do need more steel. We need, of course, um, well, I hate to spend the money on components to go get just eight components by putting a drill in there. That makes sense. What's a drill cost? And the power and everything else that's involved in it. Uh, production? Yeah, deep drill costs three components. So trading three components to get eight. Doesn't sound like a great deal. I'd rather go out and just mine them on another map again. But what would that typically be? I can see gold and uranium, maybe silver. The silver tended to be a little bit bigger quantity, kind of like the uh, the compacted steel. Huh. So what would you do in this case? Where would you go? I'll kind of leave this up and and give, give me your thoughts in the comments. I'll try to remember to pop back into this again when we uh, uh, before we leave the episode. Uh, did we get this going? We did not. That needs eight components left, and we're already basically out of components. Yeah. Nine components left. Great. Uh, Natalia, let's get you working on these. Your needs are fine. You can go through the night. Let's make some more components. Hatter to Peril of Still Sea Stars. David, you are building steel improvised turret. So let's take another look at turrets. The switches did not get put in yet. Yeah, we need another component run. That's pretty obvious. And we need to bring every pack animal that we own in the process. So that... Mega sloths. I wonder if they are pack animals. So they're, well, sloths are slow. I don't know if mega sloths are slow. Uh, any more muffalo on our map to quickly go and tame? Doesn't look like it. And we could tame an alpaca or two, but what's what do our animals look like? In fact, let's pause here. We've got a few to 
few improvements to make here. There, there's a calf that needs to be trained for hopefully, well, maybe. Muffalo 8, you're a juvenile. We need to get you guys trained on, what are these? That is, follow, okay, none of those, just on hall, which isn't a thing. Okay, not a thing for Muffalo, okay. So anyway, let's go over here. Cyprian did some training, okay. None and none. So I had Cyprian fill in a little bit while Sangria was gone, but it must mean that a lot of the art tables are, are not set to forever. Probably so. And we turned off a lot of things. That's right. So where's Mr. Squirrel? Um, yeah, we killed all of these. In fact, there's some adults right there. Let's get you guys set and ready to go. Um, over here, that's still correct. Okay. And I need to... Have we unloaded? Can I set these guys? Muffalo, you're in here. Do we have anything with saddles still on? They've moved into here. All the saddles are gone. Okay. So let's set the alpaca and muffalos back to the pasture. There and there. Boomalopes in there. Kibble. Okay. So you guys are set. You're not going to just jump up and go running. Okay. So dogs are up in here. Mr. Squirrel is still waiting for a little bit more training. It's midnight, so Sangria is in bed. And there's some more pups needing their training. We're good to their kibble or yeah, kibble zone. So we could set you guys up. And we could set... Oh, we'll leave it there and over there. Okay, that kind of forces Sangria to concentrate on just certain ones rather than setting everything for a little bit each. All right, I like that. So animals are set. And, yeah, we'll get the the little muffalos trained and ready for the next trip. The, the 1,500 pemmican. How'd that happen? Oh, we brought 500 back. Okay, we've got a lot of pemmican. Yeah. So I need to probably suspend pemmican production now. So that when we load up next time, we don't uh, start replacing it. Because next time is probably going to be the last trip for this series. We'll do it one more time, get a few other faces out there, along with our, our uh, at least two of our, of our uh, miners. Otherwise, David is working on power switch. He's going to go turn on a bank of, uh, of uh, turrets on me. We're holding fine for power. 72, 71, set. Well, we're losing power quickly, though. But it's 2 in the morning. We'll start making power at 4 in the morning when the when the sun just peaks over the horizon. So the next time we bring in components, that's the time to think about reworking this, moving this stuff out, these things out. In fact, these kind of go away. That's right. I was going, well, yeah, I need more components available. Then I want to basically destroy all of them. Rebuild six of these guys down this length. Get rid of these two. Get the six wood ones over here with the wood reserve. The six uh, uh, chem fuel generators with the chem fuel reserve. And that'll be the final design there. These guys can go away. And we'll build our last greenhouse right there. And we'll be good. So that's the plan for that. Is there... I like the pathway here. I wish there was a way to put a double wall in this. I can get just their break down granite auto door okay over there um it'd be nice to get a double wall in here but it would mean losing a path or losing grow space in between we could shove things sideways one i guess we could shove it down one that's possible maybe i can build a wall there there actually two of them over maybe just connected right to this Go up like that. This is all rich soil, too. We'll see. I'll figure that out. I, just don't, I, want, to leave, I want to leave a firefighting path between. So they can get in here and put out fires that are... You know, if we get a lightning strike in there or something. Gnarly, you're taking care of this. Good. Gnarly's on uh, night shift repairs. Indoors is 60 degrees. 62. We're good there. We left heat on in here for 64. We're maintaining it. 
Otherwise, yeah, we're back to just kind of waiting for the excitement to hit. I'm pretty sure I don't want to dive out for another trip just yet. Let's get a raid under our belts before we do that. So we've got our miners back. And I need to rethink about a few things. Um, everybody's back in alphabetical order. Shantigo, you're still set to cooking. Let's turn off your mining and turn on your cleaning. So if there's no cooking, you'll clean the kitchen. Who else left? Oath Knight. You still doctoring and back to cooking. You're really good at that. You're over here. That's a two. Yeah, set you back to there. Set, take off your construction. Take off your plant cut and take off your hauling. You'll go back to research when there's no cooking. Um, rabbit, make sure that you are still set for growing. So growing is right there as a two, your first two. So you're going to plant cut and then you're going to grow. All right, that's correct. And then let's go to mining. Where am I at? Mining. So sea stars is is yeah right there miss a p why was grow on for all three of you we weren't growing over in the other one i guess i had grow on so that you guys would would help me get this going okay so we're set there your next one is plant cut for alicia yeah that's true in fact alicia was a two on mining i want to say because she's so good at growing no that was who was that yeah, you're 11 out of 20. You were the one. Okay. So that works. You're good. Mining to hauling. Miss a P. Not hauling. You have a peg leg. Okay. Then who was the sixth one? Shantigo is done. Rabbit went with us. Klaus went with or Handy. That's what I want. Construction. And hauling. You're the fast runner. Okay. So that's good. Oops. Wrong one. What are we researching right now? We are back over here playing with the uh, the ship's parts. Okay. So, with that... Oops, that wasn't WASD. What is next? Switches. Yeah, right there. Let's turn you off. Turn you off. Who's down in this area? It must be... You're heading down here right now. You can do that one. You can do that one. That's off good there none of these were just installed okay we're good there otherwise the miners are going back to work that's what I was getting at she's probably heading for here next and then we've got somebody heading into here soon finish off the steel in this area and I guess into more of the exploratory tunnels out through there and through here so by the time we figure out what to do with the deep mining rig we're going to be out of components we kind of are let's forbid those three maybe next time we'll set up one and give it a try who's working over here that would be a radar job most likely radar you're over here you're still sleeping and is everybody now we're back to our original order okay that's good that's there Otherwise, I'm just kind of stalling. <laughs> We've had some excitement the last few episodes. Now we're just going to let them do their stuff. So what is their stuff? As long as I never see those dreaded words, colonist is idle, right there, they can go ahead and just do all the stuffs. Diamond is cleaning the kitchen as fast as they're making messes. <laughs> Good luck with that. Kibble is a bit rough right now, but low. So I need to set somebody for kibbling. So Grandma, you are not in the best shape. Uh, George is already making kibble, so I'll call that good enough. That's fine. One person should be able to maintain what we what we got going on. But we do have a lot of animals right now. We really do. I need to think about going through the pigs and kind of kind of cleaning them out. Yeah, I should do that. Though I'll probably do that off screen. No one likes to hear the squeals. <laughs> oh, oh, War Merchant. Now, well, there's a way to finish off this episode. Where did Diamond sneak off to, by the way? There you are. You are cleaning dirt down here. I'm thinking if I can get you 
to pop up into here. That would be uh, would be a great thing to do. Kind of clean that area up. You know, kind of funnel or fan your way around from there. Then the bedrooms. We get a lot of people roaming through the bedrooms, but uh, wow, we're getting all the construction done in here. You are conduit, just blasting through all that. But the bedrooms are looking pretty good. It's looking for dirt. So Diamond didn't need to get down into here. Good. Hospital is looking fine. We did a lot of work over in the jail. But someone's been here and cleaned it all up. Good. That room's good. How about the, uh, the melee rooms over here? They're looking pretty good too. So all these bedrooms are getting their last little touches done. Boom, Lope is pregnant. And War Merchant. You are... Go ahead and pop that one and jump too. At least you're not on the other map. That's good. Let you get further in. Then we'll send... I'm assuming Klaus is still our number one uh, uh, handler. Sangria. Not handler. Uh, warden. So Klaus, by how much? 15. So George is a 14. Actually, we're fairly close. Kai is a 13. David is a 12. Okay. So... I just have to remember next time to make sure that one of those four are on the next uh, uh, journey, the next, next traveling party. So, Klaus, you are where right now? And you are decent on your mood. Yeah. Inspiration work frenzy for Handy. I don't have to do anything with that. She's already working like crazy. So, Klaus, you're actually heading up in this area, hauling deer hide to armchair. Let's just send you all the way up into here. Where are you at? I want to stop you right about there. I kind of like for these guys to get a little further in. Who are we talking to over here? Got a question mark over there. Let's trade with Bat. Okay. Bat is 48 years old. And he's not really running slow. There's no uh, leg injuries, shoulder and eye. Huh, he's just he's just following up the rear there. What are you, by the way? You are a special kind of fox? A fennec fox. I've never heard of a fennec fox. That's new to me. Klaus, you're going to say hi to Bat. What do we got here? They've got 1,100 silver. That's good to see. And they're buying animals. Ooh. Okay, and they're buying all kinds of... Oh, this is... Yeah. Okay, here's the end of our episode. And they're buying statues, too. Sure. But we'll do those last. Okay, what can we get rid of here? Let's... Hmm. Yeah, I see about 20 minutes of sorting through all this mess. Huh. Tell you what, I'm going to run through all this, then I'll just summarize it afterward. I'm going to be spending a lot of time just talking to myself here. What are you guys? We have a lot of a lot of uh, retrievers in here. Yep, I'll be right back. Alright, so down here at the bottom of the list, and and I, I was still only able to get rid of one statue. I went ahead and bought an advanced plasteel helmet and different war masks and thing for, things for them to put on. Even bought a thousand, almost a thousand uh, silver Devil's Strand Parka in order to give them enough get rid of all the, the dead man apparel and get rid of lots of animals, a lot of the, the, the babies pretty much, you know, keep the ones that are already trained, get rid of all the other mouths to feed. And so I'll let you kind of, if you want to pause and kind of work your way through and see what, what I did, but I cleaned house pretty good. Went through and got rid of a lot of the bulk that we're trying to store and clear out our shelves so that we've got room for the stuff that we really do want. And that's pretty much it. They don't get into the rest of this. And there's a lot more that I'd love to sell. But with that, we're still going to give them a little bit without getting reimbursed for it. And that's going to have to be good enough. So accept and take it anyway. Yes. And pause there. Klaus, why don't you bring in... Well, bring in the medicine. And who else is around this area that can run up here and get this stuff under a roof? So you come and... And bring in that one. Uh, Kathra, you were wearing armor vest shoddy. Guess I didn't get rid of that. I'll come over here and haul this one in instead. And we got a mask over there to get get brought in. Oath Knight, why don't you come over and do this? Hauling by Bliss, okay. Um, 
This one? That one. Okay. I think that is it. Oh, there's still a couple things over there and a, and a helmet. So, yep, yeah, I'll go and clean that up. I did ask them to build some more of these, so we got to get these guys uninstalled. So that's P. Seems like a good area to do some quick construction. Um, so we get those un uninstalled. I'll get the rest of these hauled in. And guess I will catch you next time, folks. It's been Noble Rambler. See you later. Bye-bye. Mm-hmm.